Okay, so I'm going to be talking mainly in my focus on the tail end, the flip side of the rights, if you like, is that of uh, the state and other governmental actors in regard to public health or clinicians in, in regard to medical questions. But I'm really interested in on, on what sorts of responsibilities reflect back from the patient or from the citizen given those things. Okay, so the personal responsibility thing I've taken seriously, the public health thing I've taken seriously, which isn't uh, terribly difficult because that's, that's what I look at, but I've borne in mind the focus of this event. So there's a lot of clinical uh, ethics in there as well. Um, I put my abstract up just because I don't know if these slides are going to be circulated again later, but it might help people remember uh, what I'm supposed to be talking about. Uh, okay, so here's, a, here's an overview of, of how uh, this discussion will work. Jonathan has given a very detailed kind of forensic history uh, of medical law, healthcare law, as he would have us call it, of course, over the last uh, 30 or so years. Uh, I'm, I'm going to work in broader uh, <laughs> sweeps, uh, but we'll call that heuristics, okay? So it's uh, imprecision for the sake of uh, easy learning. Um, <laughs> so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to characterise medical law and ethics uh, and the burdens that gave rise to their instantiation, and then I'm going to speak to the field of public health ethics uh, and explore with you a few uh, dominant themes that have emerged in that area. Is, is, is anyone here interested, <laughs> interested in public health ethics? Ah, there's a, there's a good few, so that's, that's, <laughs> that's nice, just for the camera in case you didn't get that. There were hundreds, uh, hundreds and hundreds of hands uh, went, went up there. So that, that's very good. Uh, we, we had the, the, the allusion to, to, to lifeboats earlier on and the right to rescue. And I think in the, in the popular psyche, we have the right to rescue is what the clinical ethics people do. Do we go out and save them? Uh, and the right to rescue in a public health context just obtains in not letting people go in the sea in the first place. Mm -hmm.